All right, Galaxy S8 Plus, and what I have here is the one by one battery pack. What you'll notice is it outputs at 1.0 and 2.1. Um, there's this misconception that once you go over that 2.1 and you go to uh, 2.1, 2.4, that it's automatically fast charging. That is not the case. And I actually have a car charger that's a Qualcomm Quick Charge 2. But I noticed when I plug in the S8 Plus, it actually gives a notice that it's charging slower than the um, slower than it's supposed to, or slower than how much battery is actually being used. This is when you're using like navigation, Bluetooth, GPS, uh, streaming music while you're driving with the screen on because you're using navigation. Um, even with Quick Charge 2.0. Um, I get that notice that says the battery's charging, but it's too slow. So if I go into my phone and go under battery, and then let's go ahead and plug this in. So it's an estimated 52 minutes to fully charge under 2.1. So let's swap this to the other side, which would be the standard or just the regular 1.0. 1. 1. And you'll see here it's still giving me um, the same 53 minutes. So it's charging, it's outputting at 1.0. It actually says right there, but it says 53 minutes. Um, so this is actually an external battery pack with Quick Charge 3.0. So this is from Aki. Really nice um, presentation. Comes in this pouch. What I like about it is that it is very... Um, so I'm not going to say it's slim, but, but it's very thin. Uh, looks good it's not as bulky as some other quick chargers in one of my older videos uh, because Samsung took out the replaceable batteries um, I have I think one from Chotec it's it's pretty thick so you get the quick charge 3.0 user manual um, 24 month warranty card and then it comes with a micro USB-C cable. So you are going to have to get a um, USB, or I mean, yeah, it's a micro USB cable right here. So you got to swap it out to micro USB-C. So let's go ahead and plug this in. Notice right here, you only have one output. That also helps keep the battery thinner, so you can't charge multiple devices at once. Let's go ahead and pop this in. All right. So quick charge 3.0, so let's put this in the S8 Plus. And you see right now, estimated charging 46 minutes, but let's verify that it is fast charging. And right there, you do have fast charging with Quick Charge 3.0. So let's swap this back. So notice right there, output 2.1, but when you check the phone, it's just standard charging. So even at that higher rate of 2.1, because it's not uh, Qualcomm Quick Charge, it actually doesn't activate that fast charge. So Again, swapping back out to this one. It shows fast charging and just look at how small this battery pack is. So it's a lot thicker, but personally, I'm just carrying it around because this is like this. This is really skinny. Um, and this carry pouch is really nice. Just pop it in right there. 
there's a little bit of uh, protection in there. So if you need an external battery charger, and then right here you can actually um, clip or put things inside. So you could put the cable, so take the cable out, wrap it up, and then you could just tuck it in right there. So again, this is the Aki Quick Charge 3.0 external battery pack for the Galaxy S8 Plus. Um, I really like it. Super, I mean, just super portable. And it actually is, uh, it's pretty good at how much uh, power it offers. So over 10,000 milliamps. So again, Quick Charge 3.0 external battery pack for the Galaxy S8 Plus. I will be putting um, a link on this battery pack down in the description if you're interested in it again. And just look at that, 6,000 milliamps in this power bank, 10,000 in this one in the size difference. So again, awesome battery pack from Aki, comes with the awesome case, highly recommend this one if you have a Galaxy S8 or an S8 Plus.